Hello, and welcome to our Social Emotional Learning Lab. I'm Sonia Simons. And Jesse Walter, and we're part of your ESU 8 School Psych team. Today, we're going to talk about kindness and accepting differences. We have a little activity to show differences and similarities. But first, I want to talk about the word diversity. Diversity means a variety and a range of different things. Why does this matter to you? Because people can be very diverse. There are several things about people that can be different and several that can be the same. Some of the differences could be things like like your hair color, maybe your eye color, the color of your skin, your skin, or even the clothes that you wear every day. Even though we may look different on the outside, we are very similar on the inside. Sonia is going to share some ways with us that we are very similar on the inside. We have the same body parts like bones, muscles, hearts, lungs, and we have the same range of feelings and emotions that we can experience. We're all able to experience sadness or joy, happiness, frustration, worry, to name a few. We want to show you an example of some similarities and differences using these eggs. As you can see, our eggs look very different on the outside. My egg is white and I got it at the grocery store. My egg is brown and it came from the farm chickens. So even though our eggs look different on the outside, let's see what they look like on the inside. So as you can see, our eggs look very similar on the inside, even though their outside appearance looked different. The important thing to remember is that even though we may look different on the outside, we are very similar on the inside. So showing kindness to everyone is important, no matter how different or similar we are, because kindness is what helps us build good relationships with others. We have created a calendar of kindness to utilize for the month of May. Even though we may have many differences or similarities, we can always be kind to one another. I'm gonna share my screen so you guys can see the calendar. So every day, these are just simple things that we can do the month of May. So telling a joke, not complaining, maybe baking cookies for a friend, waving at strangers through this pandemic to show some kindness, uh, pulling weeds for a neighbor, smiling, or even making your teacher a thank you card through this time. Please like us on our social media accounts and let us know how your acts of kindness are going. Thanks for joining us today and we'll see you again next week.